Hey everybody, it's BC here, and yes, I am back with another season of Planet Nomads. I apologize for being away for so long. As some of you know, I uh, went to the other side, as they called it, the dark side, and uh, I'll be honest with you, I felt like a fish out of water in that place. It was a little too out of the norm for me. Not that there's anything wrong with it, mind you. That game had their share of issues too, but it's, it's all in the games, right? But anyways, I thought I'd start it up again. I've been hearing a lot of new additions to the game. Uh, a lot of things like uh, discovering starter wrecks. Like there should be should be one just over there. We'll go check that out in a minute. And different things. Uh, there's apparently something called uh, a dais, I do believe. I have no idea what it is. If you do know what it is, please do not spoil it for me. I want to figure it out for myself. But not only that, but we now have key bindings and powered rotors and hinges. And that was something I've been longing for for the longest time. And it would have made some of my builds probably work a little bit better, but I'm back. And I got lots of fun stuff I want to do. Uh, I am in survival, by the way. I kept the normal settings, but I changed the planet size to the full 24 kilometers. So we got lots of exploring to do and this and that. So anyways, let's go ahead and get the everything that's in here and read that journal. Uh, I haven't actually read much about it. Uh, let's go ahead and read this. Mission information, yada, yada, yada. Uh, recon and scan of habitable exoplanets. This is basically our mission agenda here. Uh, there's other stuff in here that we'll figure out as we go. But as you can see, we don't have anything but this. And yeah, so that is that. Uh, I do know about scanning blocks now, that you actually have to scan stuff to actually um, build with them now. So it's not just research and stuff. It's a matter of scanning stuff too, finding wrecks and, oh, I don't have that, I'll scan that. Now, I have sort of gone through this a little bit already, you know, maybe 15 minutes or whatever. I did a little bit of exploring, checked out the the crash site that's next to us here. And, yeah, I found the scanner there. I didn't actually do anything with it because I don't think I had, had any batteries, but I did go into my, into my old, old world. Uh, I had to do go to a backup save before Skylab. Oh my god. That thing was cartwheeled. I cannot tell you what that thing was doing. It was the only thing it wasn't doing was crashing my game, but it's a wild beast and I apologize to anybody. Anybody and everybody who downloaded that off the workshop. It's definitely a good test of the physics though. That's for sure. I'll try not to do anything that crazy this time around, but no promises. Yes, I am thirsty, I know. Is that a chunk over there? Oh, no, it's a rock. I could leave these, but I'm going to gather these. Uh, as far as setting up, we, I might actually stay around the, the skate pod here. Just just for the sake of it. And see where it goes. But yes, there are so many different things in the game now that we can do. Things we can explore. Things we go do and check out. Now, let's go see what we have over here. Oh, there's a chunk here. Uh, the the first sight I saw was sort of like half a ship, and there was a more or less a rover built ready to go on a jack stand. All I had to do was finish up the cockpit, which I borrowed a window from the from the ship, and I was able to drive away with it. So that's pretty cool. So let's go see what we got. Uh, I got a did it take me a little while to get used to the controls, and I do have to keep in mind that my jetpack will not last very long until I upgrade. And fortunately, this isn't one of those games where you have to worry about mighty disasters in the trees. But since we're here, I'll also grab some biomass. We will need some of it anyways. Because we're going to have to make batteries and fibers and fabric and all sorts of stuff. And of course, it would help if I use the right mouse button. Left mouse button, I mean. Yes, that's how I've been out of the game for a while. But anyways, let's go see what we have here. Uh, that was another thing I noticed too when I loaded up my other survival world. I was uh, checking out, oh, we got the cows here. And I was checking out the build catalog to see what new things we have. I, there's the water purifier now, which looks interesting. There's also trophies. And I, I will try to get all of them eventually. I don't know how you're supposed to collect the trophies because you need like 20, uh, 40 of the specimen, whether it be the brands, the Godillas or whatever. But I don't know if that's, you just have to, you know, dispose of them, or if you have to actually collect their, their, their remains. But here we are, it's basically the same one. I was, have been using different seeds, but 
Let's head over here and check this out. I may dismantle it. I have no idea. I don't really need the parts. But we'll go in here and there is our scanner. And another data log. Two more data logs. Alright, I'll read. This is Terry's epitaph. Okay, Danny, I won't worry about that. Preliminary scan shows that we can offload cargo near the main monument in sector two, B2A as planned. I'm going to have to set up some equipment to pinpoint the location of other monuments heading up route. Setting up data links for science teams will take some time. I expect phase one to begin in 48 hours. We need DNA data ASAP, then hand it to the boffins. I'm sure they're gonna, they'll go along nicely, but I'm t taking Lyris just in case. S subsequent debriefing with Maynard himself. Ooh, let's get it done. And let's get anyone to worry about this kind of shit anymore. Okay, I have no idea what's going on. We will figure it out. Is there anything in here? Oh, there's biomass, I'll just leave that in there for now. Is there anything in this locker? Oh, food. Ah, oh, inventory full already. Early days, huh? Hmm. Well, let's do this. We'll drag that over there, we'll drag this over here. And then we'll open up my inventory and we'll read this. Uh, doo -doo -doo. uh I'm just going to skim through it. You can pause it if you want to read it. Okay, there's that one. I'm just getting basic gifs of it. And... This. Okay, so I've completed Terry's story, and apparently it's more or less, uh, from what I can tell, genetic engineering going on. Anyway, uh, let's, let's go ahead and grab some of the drink and eat, and grab some nutrition capsules. I said nutrition capsules. Uh, get out of there. Alright, what is next? Well, let's, uh, do I have any batteries on me? I do. Okay. Let's equip this thing. Let's do some scanning. Oh, it did have a battery this time. You buggers. Okay, I don't need to scan that. Nothing there. I don't even know what I need to scan. Apparently this is all basic stuff and I don't need to worry about scanning it. Okay, fair enough. Alright, back to this. And I almost want, might want to take this. Let's take the lower over here. We'll take out the bottom window here. We won't tell anybody. We won't tell anybody about that either. Hmm. Jeez, what can I leave behind? Biomass. I'm gonna always get biomass. Pick that up. Oh, that's the wrong one. Alright, now we can take this out. We actually have a cart now. All right. I gotta admit, I, I do like the starters, starting scene they have now. And let's zoom out, and off we go. So now what we'll do, I think. Actually, what I'm gonna do? I do a bit of a cut here. I think I'm gonna borrow some of these parts so we can start unlocking some stuff. So I shall return. Okay, I'm back. I grabbed a few things, just some plates, glass, frames, and some circuits. But apparently, I do have something scannable here. So I get to scan my first thing. And I got the jack tool, which isn't even on there anymore. Ha ha ha. Let's see if there's anything else here I can scan. Or does it just scan the whole grid? And I have a feeling that's what it's doing. Even though the jack wasn't still attached to that thing. But I think it's time that we start unlocking stuff. So first we gotta go ahead and build our emergency 3D printer. Our super expensive cheating machine. Okay, and bring out the emergency tool. Get some light for you guys. Okay, and there we go. So we got that. What does that unlock? Unlocks the base foundation. Well, of course, we're gonna do that because we're gonna have to build build a house. And let's see where would it be a good spot to set this up. Oh, 
that would be an auto save. I maybe maybe gone for the game for a while, but I still recognize those. Hmm. You know what? Let's go right down here. Something like that, and we'll go there and. Where are you? Yeah, it might be easier on this side. Actually, probably be easier in third person, but. Get that out of my face so I can see what I'm doing, please. Yeah, perfect. Go ahead, say it, noob. All right, and we got the printer 2.0. All right, uh, what I want to do? I just want to get some color here. Hmm. Let's go with brown. Why not? Jeez, I used to complain about the Mark One tool. This emergency tool is even worse. At least it doesn't need batteries. But you know, if you're building with something other than base foundations, it could take a while. Okay. So now we go back to the catalog where that unlocked that got us the uh, printer 2.0, which doesn't even show up in here. Nope, let's, uh, was it in here? Oh, yes. Okay, interesting. How does this work? Side objectives. But I don't see printer 2.0. Do I need to have this stuff on me and then upgrade this thing? Possibly. Let's build another one. Just because we can. And this one we will make. That looks more pink than white. And we'll make it gray. Just because. Oh. I know what I'm doing, trust me. Alright, now it says just to keep building? What? I'm sorry, I need to check this out, what's going on here. Let me check this journal again. Does this mean I have to print these things? I'm guessing. I think the only thing I don't have. Well, I gotta. Yeah, I gotta get some supplies. All right. Well, then, uh, do I even have any storage right now? No, I do not. Actually, I do. Where is it? There it is. I didn't take it apart this time. Thank God. Can I scan it? No, I can't. I can't scan anything here. All right. Anyways, uh, let's put. And shift click is not working for me. Like the shift alt control click doesn't work. That's fine. And yeah, I'll put the bandages in. So now I gotta find some resources right here. Always right here. Usually right here. I guess not. We'll go ahead up some boulders. Get some carbon, iron, silicon. Uh, I think I still have biomass on me. I'm not sure, but let's find out. See what we even get from this stuff now. That wasn't too bad. It's a start. So I'm going to take apart a few rocks and I shall return. Okay, I'm going to have to be careful. There's actually some fireflies there. Yeah, I didn't even see them. I walked up close and they just started swarming me. Anyway, I'm going to go hit up another rock and I'll return. Okay, I got a bunch of iron, bunch of carbon, bunch of silicone, and some biomass. And I discovered there's fireflies everywhere around this area. I really do have to watch out for that. Anyway, uh, iron, iron, carbon, silicone, and biomass. Now, what did I have to build? Two, two frames, two plates, four electronics for mechanical parts. So, two plates, two frames, or sorry, two frames, two plates, 
uh, four mechanical parts or electronic parts, and then four mechanical. Oh, well, this is interesting. That's cool. I like that. Good job, guys. Crane balls. You guys are great. Really put something into this. I'm really liking this. Little tasks, things to do. So there's the print plates, and just waiting for the rest of it to go through. And I will. Let's actually look at the block catalog. We probably should start getting a bit of a house set up or even unlocking stuff. What is that? Oh, that's the ceiling tile. Uh, wall corner. All right, let's let's go ahead and build our wall corner so we can get this out of the way. Uh, uh, wrong key again. Okay. That's almost done. So where do we at? Where are we at the block catalog? So we got the ceiling tiles. Okay, what is that? Oh, it's kind of hard to see because I'm seeing the shadow of this. So, usual stuff. So, the next one is going to be, I'm guessing, ceiling panel. Okay, let's uh, get the right keys here. It's going to look like an, it's going to be an ugly base for now, but just so I can unlock stuff and go from there. Plus, we can always disassemble everything, so not that big of a deal. Okay, and... E you are not done yet. So that ceiling tile, let's go ahead and grab our armor block. I know I'm not going to be able to unlock everything this way because that's why we have this thing that I keep pulling out instead of my multi-tool. Because I don't have the proper multi-tool yet. And there we go. We're making slowly making progress. And I make the jack tool and that's going to unlock a whole bunch of stuff. But I don't actually see anything in here. Hmm. Let's see what happens. All right, objective complete. Oh, cool, it's an actual reward. Okay, now what do we get? So now let's get into this stuff here. Okay, so let's, uh, let's go into our journal here. So, okay, so I should have compact printer. It needs power now. Now, do I have the biomass generator? Or bio generator. I do. Compact 3D printer. They called it printer 2.0. It's kind of funny. You have to build something that uses power before you build something that creates power. Just saying. Let's not talk about that. Might have to get used to it until I get some uh, better things. Bon appetit. New objective. Build a food and drink machine. I think I can do that. Um, I probably should get a bit of a base set up here too. Uh, let me take my recording time. Okay, we're not doing too bad. So I think what I'll do is, I think we'll actually expand this a little bit. Uh, let's go ahead and change that to... Uh, gray looks more green now than it used to. I don't know why. Maybe it's just me. Hmm. I'll stick with the brown. Why not? Alright, now it's just a matter of figuring out where this is supposed to line up. It has been uh, so long since I've built in this game. See, I remembered. I remembered the right button this time. Objective complete. Build and print. Is there something else I was supposed to do? Oh, I didn't know there was, didn't know there was more to it. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention to this. Oh, oh, hello. Find a scan, use secondary pulse scan. Secondary? Oh, hello. I like that. Good job, cream balls, good job. Love it. And how, oh, it stays up until you click again. All right, so I'm going to go back over here then. Let's go hop in the buggy. 
That's kind of cheaty though. You can see the ores, the food, but it doesn't tell you what ore it is. I don't know how long it stays up for. Anyway, uh, let us go. I'm sure there's a setting somewhere. Oh, I went the wrong way. Yeah, and I'm sure I've said this many times before. Which way are we going here? That way. Yeah, that's that way. It's behind my beacon. But that's the thing about playing early access games. Is when you start playing them early in development, you see them for what they are and you appreciate for for what you have. And then as the game develops and you start seeing more and more additions and improvements to the game, it, it adds more playability to a game you already enjoy. And yeah, it's good. It's they've come a long way since I've started playing. And from what I've heard, come a long way since before I started playing. Moo. Anyway, let's see what this thing does. Now it's I apparently can use this to scan beacons. Apparently. Now there's thrusters there. There's a beacon there. Oh. Okay, so they've been here for a year. Interesting. And since it's saying scan one, I can't scan again. Okay, is there anything else I can scan? No. I did not see you there. I can scan you though. From afar. New rewards and torch trophy. That's what I'm talking about. But what does that mean? Does that mean I have to collect or dispose of 40 Minotaur? Or what were they called again? Xenotar, yeah, yeah. I know what I'm talking about. Alright, so that's all I was supposed to do here, I guess. Scanner battery depleted. Not anymore. Ooh, what's that? Let's go find out. There's one over there, too. Hmm. And I can't bring up the scan from in here again. We might have to hoof it. But anyways, I wanted to just check that out. So let's uh, check our journal here again, see what other objectives we have. So let's find the crew. So that's just Matt. Uh, 600 meter radius from our drop pod. Okay, so we'll do, look at that. Uh, crystallize. And this is just scanning all the things. Okay, I did see another, wait, that there is apparently another resource we get too. Let me scan the monuments. And scan the beacons, okay, and then there's an egg hunt. Uh, cool. I like it. I really do. Anyway, it is getting dark, so what I'm going to do is go back to the wreck to take parts and not rebuild them. And, yeah, just to get, get us started so we can get a place, a roof over our head at least. So I shall return. Okay, I'm back. I grabbed a whole bunch of stuff there, just for the hell of it. Uh, just to save me stuff to produce, but uh, there's another thing I noticed too. If you look at the visor, they actually have the water effect on the visor now, which is it's an interesting touch. So yeah, now it's a matter of getting the place set up. What do I even have unlocked right now? Well, we do have a door, so I guess we can start with door. Um, I think we'll go with white, just because. So I got one, two, put it right there. Okay, and then. We're gonna go with windows if I have windows. Reinforced wall with door. Oh. Alright. Just gonna finish this and I can start building some windows. And there they are. Nice. Okay. Let's get
going to be a modest little place for now until until the craziness begins. Uh, I've still have yet to build BC Lab or BCP Labs, which may or may not be a thing, but we'll find out. As far as what I want to do with this series, I haven't really decided. I'm just gonna just go with the flow and let it take me where it takes me. We got so many different things to do now and different things to work with, so it's really is a whole new ball game. Oh yeah, that was all the ores. But I can't actually make a cabinet. Let's actually do that right now so I have a place to put all this stuff. I know it doesn't despawn, but it gets pretty cluttered in here. Okay. Do that. Not that, but that. Oh, I'll move it once I get the mover tool. That is fine. So biomass, iron. Uh, let's oh. Wrong way. Yes. Clean up the floor right here. Can't wait to get another suit, so I get an inventory upgrade. Okay, and carbon. So we do have a few supplies right now. Let's get, take that apart. Get that out of the way. And that. Okay. Now we go back to Windows, which is 9. One, two, three, two on this side, and get some corners back in here, which was number four, all the way back at number four. One there, Let's see if we can sneak one in the back here, and one over here. Oh, I already did that corner, this one. Oh. Like I said, it's going to be a thing gonna be a thing until I get a better tool. And they don't mean me. Oh. Well the auto saves are better. Mind you, I don't have a hundred thousand blocks built yet. But yeah, this is gonna take a moment, so uh I'm gonna finish up the walls, get a roof on here, and then finish it up and I'll show you how it looks. Alright, well, there's the outside for now. It's nothing much. Just a white building, black roof. Uh, it's supposed to be a brown floor. Yes. Brown floor. I was going to put a ramp here or some stairs or something, but I haven't found them yet or I haven't unlocked them yet. And I have no idea where they would be. Uh, in theory, you'd think I'd have to build something here. Let's do the food and drink machine. Yes, I was just, just talking about that. Uh, it's a compact food and drink machine. Uh, do we not have the big food and drink machine? It's probably here and I just don't see it. No, it's the med bay. Uh, let's check the journal, see what the journal says. Uh, bon appetit. Alright, well, we're just building the compact one then. Put that on zero. Uh, get out of the menu here. What color should we make this? Sure. Make it green. For now, we can always change the color later. Yes, I know. Wrong button. Okay. Now, what does that get us? create a clean water and create processed food and you need power all right uh, let me get a yeah I guess we'll get a generator in here I should have the biomass unlocked there it is I don't know if I have the parts for it or not but we'll find out in in a moment Hmm. Keep forgetting about that corner. It doesn't like going in there. Oh, I actually have enough parts for it. Sweet. That gets that. We get our terminal. We need a switchboard. Yes, I still know how to play the game. And I'm going to do what everybody up. So many people have done and place a switchboard right on this conveyor port, but I'm going to be smart. I'm actually going to connect it right to the generator. 
Uh, what else needs power? You need power. You need power. And if I can, get some lights in here. Oh, I do have them. Perfect. Okay, I'll put one there and one there. And coloring. That will make them white. I need glass. I don't even have enough to make it. Hmm. Do I have anything here? No, I do not. I'm sure I can find some silicone around. As much as I don't want to do this, I'm going after the nest. Actually, I should scan them first. See if I can scan them. No, apparently not. Alright, uh, you know what? I should eat and drink first. Because I think they take down your, your water at least. That's the wrong locker. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm an idiot. I just remembered I had all my stuff in this little container over here because I couldn't build up this thing. Alright, well, use. Use that. Use that. Let's get rid of these guys, because they're right on my doorstep. Oh, wow. Uh, they actually hit hard. Oh, wow. I've, they've changed significantly. Alright. Oh, that's actually what I went out. That's why I got rid of them. So I can get to the silicone that's here. I think I've only been attacked by those guys maybe once or twice. This will make it the second or third time, I guess. Uh, usually when I run into them, I'm in a vehicle, so I just drive right over them. Alright, up we go into here, so we can make some glass. We make... Two glass. Alright, what else do we need in here? We need stasis chamber, that's what I was going for. And I think I actually have enough to build that. What color is my bed going to be? I don't know. Why is it building upside down? Don't know. But I have enough to build it. That's all that matters. And I got the water purifier ready. Alright, we got an objective. I wonder if we get any rewards for it. First, let's do that. Yeah, I think that you, that changed. I thought when you place... Maybe it didn't. I must be thinking something different. Alright, what does the journal say? Gear up. Build the compact arm, armory to get to the next tier, tier tool. And we will do that, and we will do this in the next one. But the only thing left to do now is... Power everything up. And just pray to God this generator has enough to actually produce. Yeah. Give me biomass. And I thought I would have gotten biomass from just, Oh, yeah, because I uh, right clicked it. That's right. And we have power. Which means I can turn that off. And with that, I think we're going to call the episode. Uh, thank you, everybody, so much for sticking around for the channel. Uh, I'm sure you all knew, all knew that I would be back someday. And here I am. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.